Well, the time has come. Champions League is here, and the host Glasgow City in Edinburgh get things started for 2018-19. It has been four seasons since they have been in the group stage, but they are back at this phase of the competition and host like they were in 2014. Albeit this time, we are at the Orium. Opponents are Andalite, Belgian champions, passing standard Liège on the first title in 20 years. To the sides for City, well, the starting line unchanged from Sunday, although they did rest a few players after being in a reasonably comfortable position at halftime against Celtic. Abby Grant scored a hat trick against Cadigan last year. She stopped scorer with 16 goals in all competitions. While uh, Ivanusa, first Champions League PN for her for City, but the coolest has some experience with Potsdam. For Andalet, champions as I mentioned, Patrick Vachild is the coach who coached Standard Relation when City played them five seasons ago. Some scorers of notes, you know, Vinance up top, along with De Cagney and Van Kerkhoven. They will be the threats, Laura Dinaway is their captain. Referee for this one is Tanya Subotic from Slovenia. Still that one back here for Doherty. No one really got a calm by the possession yet in the first four minutes, but from Tisson, cool from Alexander Patterson. Now Kulis has time to stretch her legs. I'm all, I'm all side. Two or three racing in now. Even the said I know it's. A little bit loose and Odiers has to put it behind. Not comfortable at all there, the defender and keeper, but positive in the play. And Lydia Kulis. Got a committee meeting going on with the three underlying players. Dekagny's leaving it, Denev, he is there. Three players became two. It sails over from Tafu. Not a million miles away, but the first real sighter of gold they've had. Uh, Van der Legt. Kite that's came off her and Kirkhoven there, there, Ross. It's there in front. Talking about slides up the channel. Cool has tried to keep it in and probably has given away the foul here, has she? And Deleuze. Oh, a bit messy there. I think trying to keep it in play to get it away off, up the mark, but perhaps they should have just conceded the throw and they've conceded a free kick now. And it goes from Yaki Ayers. Oh, and it's a goal! And the Belgian champions have the lead here in the 24th minute. And the tall figure that is on Kirkhoven, bottom of the mush pit. And heading aside into the lead. Crichton got it off to loose. Care. Now Lydia Coolis. Even this side, the only one in the centre. It's going to be too high for even this side. Might come for Grant. It's going to hit it first time. Merkel's with the block. Crichton, it's going to go over. Bit of pace. And uh, although the initial cross is just a little too high for even said Grant was falling up trying to score a summer goal as she did at the I think if you think back to Kazigat from that side, blast it in, but it was uh, cleared away just off the line, just before the line. Decent response after going behind. 29th minute. And Ross looking to find the leveller. Near post again looking for Patterson. Is there handball? The penalty off Van Gorp. And five minutes or so after conceding, they've got the chance from the penalty spot here. Flicked up of Patterson. Yellow card as well shown. Taking some age here for a ball to be set. And there's Ross. Oh, it's off the post, off the keeper. Rebound is saved. Champions League demons continue. I think everyone thought it was in, but just ricocheting away off the post. 
Drama here. Oh, centre towards Patterson at the near post. It's going to be scrambled. No, it's not. It is scrambled, but away from goal. Love goes direct through the middle. Foley. Ends a pass to play. Belgians have the lead. It is Glasgow City now and the light one. Second half then, restarting Glasgow City with a job to do. One behind, don't want to be facing and a big chance elimination before the second and third group games because it will be, all, be very difficult to qualify unless loads of points are taken up each other in the group. Cool's doing well to find even a set. Space for Abbey Grant, the first 30 seconds of the second half. Twist turns, but high from Abbey Grant. A good play from Killers on even that. There was the space found for Abbey Grant. Positive early move. <laughs> Onside, that great ball from Kirkhoven, and now Van Goop. And what a moment there for Alexander. Ryan Ants was coming in to try and tap in for number two on the break. A deadly break it was. That's Scotland's number one. As I gobbled it up well. All around Tison doing well. Dunluce looking to find the delivery. Free header goes by. That was a big chance there for the Kaine. Big chance wasted. And Kirk Owen's head and space through the middle here for Van Gorp and that is Curtains surely for the afternoon for Glasgow City long ball and although it's group stage knockout football it almost feels like because it's very tough to lose the first game of qualify and I'd like to have came to Thorium and have a 2-0 lead with 8 minutes left and nothing head and hope which bounced through and City need at least a couple of goals in the last eight minutes here. How it? Here's Clark through goal side. Chance here for Jenna Clark. Chance gone. Is that hope's gone? Did really well to get round in the bait. Can you get that on target? Tiny pass, Kerr. De Gorp, sliding pass, Gerasole. Alexander with the save. And that's off the crossbar there from Van Kerkhoven, the score, the opener. And almost even worse. Really Diki down that side just with some support. Kindly just ticking down that clock in this final minute here. Up towards Clark. Coolis. Flag stays down here for Kirsty Howitt. And it's going to go in here for even a sub, but it's too late. Unfortunately, you'd think 20 seconds or so left. And well, how it's good run. There was three, four, five getting forward. It was bound to happen, but too little, too late, perhaps. It is Eunice's first goal for Glasgow City. And that is full time and problems, big problems. Early in the game developed into is that game over for the chances of reaching the last 32. Six points. Very difficult to get through unless points are dropped elsewhere. That's what City will be relying on winning their two games that they've got left. Unlegged threatening on the counter, got their goals first half. Ella Van Kerkhoven scoring from a good delivery in. Leon Ross with a penalty to hit the post. 
in that first half a few minutes later. And then in the second half, a sucker punch second. Sucker punch caught with it. There was that very last second goal from Larry, even just a bit. A first goal for Glasgow City. All in disappointment, and will be disappointing for the home crowd here. Final score at the Orium in the opening game of the qualifying round Glasgow City 1, Anderlecht 2.